Hey guys and welcome to the final part of Facts About Walt Disney. So before we get started, I just want to say everything we have here is from Factinate. Uh, it's a really good website if you've just got a bit of spare time you want to learn about certain things. It has facts about everything, so the link for that will be down below. But let's get into number one. So, fact number one. Walt Disney's films have produced a number of hit songs over the years, but Disney's personal favourite was the ballad Feed the Birds from Mary Poppins. According to songwriter Richard Sherman, Disney used to stop by his and his brother's office on Friday afternoons and request a personal performance of the song. Sherman said he loved that song and knew it was the heartbeat of the whole movie. Tuppence the bag. Tuppence, 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 a bag. <laughs> <laughs> don't think right. we'd have liked that rendition of it. I don't think we it. would make it. <laughs> Fact number two. When Disney wanted to produce an animated feature-length Snow White film, many people in Hollywood doubted him and some even called it Disney's folly. I don't really know what a folly is. The film earned $184.9 million worldwide in 1938 and is still one of the highest grossing animated films of all time. Mm-hmm. All them doubters that thought it was a folly. Mm. Mm. 184.9 million. million. At, in 1938 as well. I think how much that was like back then. But anyway, let's see what folly is. Define folly. Lack of good sense. Foolishness. Do oh. you want to hear the next one? No thanks. So they thought he was stupid, basically. It's not very nice. That's well mean. It's strange. But anyway, yeah, so it earned $184.9 million worldwide in just 1938 that and is still one of the highest grossing animated films. That's a big films. up yours to all those people who were like, nah, he can't do it. Mm -hmm. What's he doing? Crazy fool. Yeah. So, fact number three, this one literally blew my mind. Like, I love this. Walt Disney hired his housekeeper to cook at the... That's a good fact. Walt Disney hired his housekeeper and cook, Thelma Howard, in 1951. She worked for his family for three decades. As part of her annual Christmas gift, mm. Disney gave her stock in the company. Oh my. That stock made her a multi-millionaire by the time she died in 1994. She was a cook. Cleaner she was a cook. cleaner and a cook. She was housekeeper and, and a cook. cook. I'd go and clean his toilet for stocks in Disney. Mm -hmm. I'd wipe his bum for stocks Stock, in Disney. Stocks are the way to make <laughs> the big money these days. <laughs> Especially in Disney. Mm. Fact number four. Trash cans at Disney World were placed 25 steps away from hot dog stands. That's a bit odd. Disney arrived at this measurement because that was how long it took him to eat a hot dog. He could eat a hot dog in 25 steps. Hopefully not the foot long. No, it would be a normal one, wouldn't it? <laughs> You'd think, if you could eat... That's a, a fact for Dad, that. Any facts yeah. about Disney bins. Yeah. That's going to sound really, really weird. <laughs> My dad likes the bins in Disney, and he is currently building himself one. Yeah, but they are pretty cool, like, as far as being go. Like, yeah. They are cool bins. I mean... 25 steps. I'm trying to like think. Like, I don't think I could eat one in 25 steps. Well, I don't think he's like constantly like walking really fast, is he? It's just like 25 step stroll whilst munching on a hot yeah. dog. But they're not fast. It's not like he's sprinting. No, like, exactly. One, two, three, four. Like, oh. Oh. <laughs> so fact number five is in 2000, Walt Disney was inducted into the National Inventors Hall of Fame for his creation of the multiplane camera. Disney used the camera to film Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs and it was developed in order to produce a more realistic and emotionally affecting animation. So I've actually like seen about this in some of the documentaries I've watched and it literally they did have like separate like panes where they would like layer up different parts mm. of the image. Oh yeah, I so, remember seeing that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's really cool. I would really recommend. I can't remember for the life of me what documentary it was because I've watched so many. Uh... Was the animation thing? Pixar one, or oh, maybe no, it wouldn't no, have been Pixar. Um, or imagine, imagine it. It might be in Imagineering, Imagineer. actually. Yeah, yeah. That's the one. I think it might be in that. I'm yeah, not sure. but I'm sure it's in quite a few because it is something that's so big. It's really interesting to go and learn about how he kind of came about to do Snow White <laughs> with that amazing piece of technology. Yeah. So moving on to number six, the robot from robot, the robot, robot. <laughs> the robot, the farmer, robot, the robot. <laughs> 
from Wally was named for Walt Disney. What? Wally is a modified version of his full name, Walter Elias Disney. Oh, how did I not guess that? That's awesome. Uh, the character of Wally, like Disney himself, is loved and adored by children and families around the world. And us. How does that not click in my brain? Wally, Walter, E. Wow. Again, That's cool. mind blown. <laughs> I know, and it's one of our favourite films, so it is. do a Wally impression. Wally. Final fact of today's video and the final fact of the series. Set sad face. times, I know. We'll do another one on something else soon. Is that Cinderella was Disney's favourite princess. He told the actress who voiced the character that she was his favourite heroine and that there was something about the story that he associated with. So there was just something about it that he really connected with and yeah. that led to Cinderella being For many his people, number one. like for a long time at least she was a favourite. Yeah. Maybe in like newer films and things of other princesses that have come about. Maybe not so much now. But... Yeah, definitely. Like I don't personally I don't think she was ever one of my favourites. Sorry. It's because you'd be one of the ugly stepsisters. <laughs> Thanks. Um, but I know she is a favourite for a lot of people and obviously I guess like the castle is like the Cinderella castle. Yeah. And, um that's obviously a major, major part of Disney. Um yeah, I think I'm a bit more of a more future Disney princess. A modern princess. Yes. That is our last seven facts about Walt Disney. There are many, 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 mm. many more facts that we could tell you, not just yeah. off this website, but off of many. Cause yeah, we only selected a few. We didn't go through every single one yeah. on here. So there's plenty more. If you want to click the link in the description, go like check that out. Um, this isn't an ad or anything, by the way. No. It probably sounds like it is. But it's, it's just ad, so you guys can, like, go and check out the rest of the facts. There's so many on there. Um, but yeah, that's going to be the end of this little mini series. We will be doing another one mm -hmm. soon, which means we'll be putting up another poll very soon. Uh, so make sure, again, keep in the description down below. Mm -hmm. Keep your eyes peeled. Because on all our social medias, so we've got Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, <laughs> um, <laughs> all those links down below. Click those, follow us, whatever, um, so you can get involved with the polls. And just get involved, involved with the polls. And involved with us. Yeah. Oh, I'm knocking things yeah. over. We love chatting to you guys and interacting and getting ideas and everything from you, so. Yeah, well, um, that is going to be the end of today's video. Today. I was going to get my words wrong, so just started it instead. Nice, sweet. Um, if you have liked, hit the thumbs up, smash the subscribe down below, and we'll see you real soon for another video. Bye. Bye. Oh, I hit my elbow. Ding, Ding dong. dong.